Stampers is Gigi with Stamp Fanatics. Thanks for joining me today. And I wanted to show you some ideas that I had from our celebration where we earn our free products and that's only for two more weeks till February 28th. But on page six, we have this Dainty Flowers 12 by 12 designer series paper that you can earn for free with a $50 order. And you can order with me right here at stampfanatics.com. Just press shop. Anyway, um, the paper is beautiful, and I just wanted to show you all the ideas that I had. Now, there is a sheet that has a lot of these circular uh, patterns on it. There's six of them on a page. And then there's also, let's see if I can find it, um, two of these sheets that I made cards with that are on the same sheet. So I just wanted to show you that you can cut these down to card size, and then I pulled out some of my little animals and things to make different themed cards. And this one says, you've got a friend in me. I've got one with the bunny punch <clears throat> that is thank uh, Happy Easter. And look at the cute little butterfly. And I just embellished it with whatever um, little dots or things that I had or gems or this one I had sequins. But anyway, there's one with the bunny in it. Is that spring or what? Um, a silly goose told me it's your birthday, makes an adorable birthday card. And here's another one with the Easter little bunny. Enjoy all the little moments. And this would be even cute for a baby's card. And it's just, like I said, so colorful. You can use different color backgrounds for your card stocks. Um, okay, then I have, I just actually just did a card front and cut out a lot of this paper and did different happy birthdays. So I did, um, let's see, what was the color on this one? It was Starry Sky is my background color and that I stamped. Uh, Fresh Freesia was that one. And I did a second one of that. And then this one I have Rich Razzleberry. I mean, you can pick out the different colors in there and just change up the back of your card. And let's see, oh, and then I have, like I said, these strips. This is more of the designer series paper, so I just used a little bit of each. Stamped happy birthday, put a few embellishments. I have a nice birthday card. Here's a nice thank you version of the same paper. Doing the same thing, just different designer paper um, that comes in that pack. And then this one I saw another designer do, and um, I just changed it and put a little ribbon up here instead of, um, I think she used twine. But anyway, a whole background piece of this paper and um, just cut out a circle of the paper. It's so beautiful. And then added just a little reminder that you're loved just to pick somebody up or you could even send it as a, a Valentine's Day card. So um, speaking of Valentine's too, and this was just some ideas. I still have more of the paper, but I really just wanted to start chopping it and using it. Because a lot of times, you know, we buy our designer paper and then we don't really want to cut it. Well, I just went in there and cut this up because I knew it would make so many different types of cards with different themes. So because today's Valentine's Day, I actually just went to Target and picked up one of these. I didn't have to bake anything. It's a Rice Krispie treat. And I made a little header, which is just a piece of cardstock folded in half. And I used some of our um, Country Bouquet gingham uh, paper and then the stamp set from the Country Bouquet. I stamped the hearts, Happy Valentine's Day, and look, I have a quick and easy gift. So I'm gonna probably give this one to my husband. But um, anyway, I just want to wish you a Happy Valentine's Day. And don't forget, we only have two more weeks for our celebration for you to go through. And there's, yeah, there's beautiful stamp sets and things in here. But don't forget about all the beautiful designer series paper. So if you haven't gotten some of this yet and you know you're going to be placing an order for $50, go ahead and you can order this paper for free. I'm telling you, you will make so many different cards out of it. There's even more ideas in the catalog. Don't forget to look at that and get more ideas of what you can do. And they're simple. They're not real hard to put together. And then there's an animal theme uh, designer series paper. These are times like when you should really stock up on these great papers our designer paper is so beautiful and it's usually two-sided so you get a lot of purpose out of it and so here's a nice floral one if you like florals um here's another one now this is a huge pack this one is with a hundred dollar order but it has so much paper it'll take you through all of spring you know into mother's day i mean it's just got so many beautiful pastel uh prints in there 
And then um, I think that was it. And then the rest of it are all stamp sets that you can earn. So don't forget to take advantage of this. This is our one and only sale this year. We're not going to have a second one. And so look at all the cards, once again, that you can make just out of one pack of designer series paper. And I have more paper to make. Like I can make a lot of duplicates of this and just keep going and going. And then if you want, just go ahead and get these ready. And then when you need a birthday card quick, you can just put it on a piece of cardstock and you've got more. So thanks for joining me. I just wanted to show you some of these quick and fast, easy ideas for you for cards using free paper. How good is that? <laughs> thanks for joining me today. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And um, I have more details about this Valentine gift in my newsletter. So if you're not signed up for my newsletter, just go to stampfanatics.com and you can sign up for my newsletter and you'll get a weekly newsletter with a new idea. Thanks for joining me and have a great day.